Hello, I'm Harish Gaur, Director of Product Marketing on the Databricks Marketplace team. Databricks Marketplace is an open marketplace for all your data, analytics, and AI needs. In this video, I'll demonstrate a three-step process to become a private exchange provider on Databricks Marketplace. Private exchanges enable you to share data products with a defined group of consumers. Private exchange listings do not appear in the public marketplace. However, before you can create a private exchange, you will need to be onboarded as a private exchange provider. All Databricks customers can now become private exchange providers right from within the product. Previously, customers had to become a public marketplace provider in order to use the private exchange feature. Now, you can just be a private exchange provider without being a public provider. So we've made the process simple and more direct. Let's get started. First, as a Databricks account admin, you will log into your Databricks workspace and visit the Marketplace section. Next, click the Provider Console. If your account has not yet been onboarded as a provider, the Provider Console will display the Get Started page. Click the Private Provider Terms link. You can now agree to the Private Exchange Provider Terms and complete the setup directly from within the product in a self-serve manner. This improvement brings several advantages, including speed, ease of use, and it lowers the barrier to entry to set up a private exchange. Once you have accepted the terms, it's time to enable the private exchange provider option in the account console. This takes you to the Databricks account console in a new browser tab Go ahead and open Feature Enablement tab. Enable the Marketplace Private Exchange Provider option. That completes step one of three. We have accepted the terms and we have enabled Private Exchange Provider option. Let's move on to step number two. Return to the Provider Console in the workspace. You will assign a Marketplace admin during this step. Click the Refresh button. Do not use your browser's refresh page functionality. After a few minutes, the Assign Marketplace Admin button appears. Click it to open your user page in the Account Console. On the Roles tab, enable Marketplace Admin. Keep in mind, you can choose to assign the Marketplace Admin role to another user or users. If you do, they continue the process from this point on. If you assign the role to yourself, you can continue the process. That completes step number two. Now the last step, return to the provider console in the workspace. You will create a provider profile in this step. Your provider profile gives you the opportunity to tell prospective consumers who you are and to group your data products under a single brand. Click the refresh button. After a few minutes, the Create Provider Profile button appears. Click it to open the Create Profile page. Enter the following information. All fields are required. The provider name, logo, description, organization website, business and support email, terms of service link, privacy policy. To speed up the creation of the provider profile, I have filled in sample data. Go ahead and save the profile. That completes step number three. Your private provider profile has now been created and you are ready to create your first private exchange. Thank you for watching this demo. By following these steps, you can sign up to be a private exchange provider on Databricks Marketplace. This new feature eliminates the extra step of being a public provider and makes the onboarding process simple for all Databricks customers looking to set up a private exchange.